So the Pats ate a steam tray of dick against Baltimore. Indeed, Dan. They could have dressed 45 me's out there and we'd have played better. Quite possibly one of the saddest Patriot games I've ever seen. Yeah, it was almost as sad as watching me try and eat a slice of pizza. I got no chance. Really now, ghost of Tony Dungy? Yep, two bites in and I'm full. <laughs> <laughs> Your thoughts, Human Growth Harrison? Yeah, that game was pathetic. Pathetic is watching old people try and fuck. Yep. Would you agree, Dungy Ghost? Mm-hmm. Where do you think it all went wrong for the Pats? I guess when all the Patriot greats started getting old. Why, in my youth, I used to be able to eat a whole candy bar by myself. Wow, talking to Dungy Ghost is like watching Sunday's Pats game. We get to watch people wither and die right before our fucking eyes. So the Pats got gangbanged in the playoffs at home, and they're clearly not the same team as before. But they still have Belichick and Brady. They'll be back, right? You better motherfucking believe the Pats will be back, Dan Patrick. Because the shit hit the fans at a thousand miles an hour Sunday. And now everyone has shit on their face. <laughs> you think the last image Belichick and Brady want for their fans is of Ray Lewis's balls in their mouth? Their efforts to tackle Ray Rice Sunday were as feeble as my efforts to tackle a Happy Meal. Two bites in and ba da ba ba ba. I'm all finished. Been a great run for the Pats, but you wonder if they'll ever return to their once dominant form. I wonder sometimes where dreams go, like if there's a magical net that catches them all up in the sky. I think I'm gonna go fucking hang myself. <laughs>